Smash it with a hammer. Morena, my urchins. Welcome back to Sengoku Dynasty. I'm still not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. We got our bell tower in. I did say we're going to check out this tower, so we're going to head straight up there. And I've got to head back and talk to Tosichi. There's an animal sound happening here. I don't know where it's coming from. Oh, that's the deer growling. Just made it up this tower. And there's nothing here except some yaris. But this is beautiful. So that's going to be our village down there. Can you imagine that's the center. We can have some houses. Ooh, I have no idea where we're going to put the houses. We can branch off up here as well. Have that overlooking the valley. And then just further down we've got our lake. So I'm going to run back to Toshichi and find out how to build my village. People are curious where I've just made camp. This is my spot here. Player village 1. So I'm assuming that once we get permission to build more villages we can name the villages. And that tower is just right here. So the map's actually not as big as I thought it was going to be. It doesn't take too long to get across the map. Oh, I was just running through the grassy field and I just saw a lady. Is that a lady? Scary lady. That's for sure. Need you. Yes, I'm afraid of you. Okay, she doesn't do anything. She's got a fire pit here. Can I? No, I cannot use it. Those trees look really nice. Look at these bushes. Hey lady, do you have anything in your house? I'm going to steal it. Loot. Let's take it all. I don't know what it is, but we're going to take it. If we've learnt anything from any games is take everything, don't give anything back. Berries we're going to take. Vegetable meal, yes, we are hungry. You can see he's starving. I think we've ransacked this lady. Now we're going to ask her for, see if she needs anything. Oh, she's a prayer lady priestess. She suggested going to the hot springs, which we will do at some point. We're back in the burnt down village. We're going to talk to this main guy again and see if he... That man's doing the good old squatto and he just did a weird stand-up squat doing his exercises in the morning. Hello. I wonder if this game was trying to get you to build your bell tower right here in this village and not wherever you wanted to build. I think when I get a new bell tower, I'll... I'll put one in, in this spot here, but now I have to go back to my village. We're hungry, so we need to find some food too. Should I grab my hammer? Can I build a fire pit? Let's just do this one. I'll put that there. We'll cook our meat, because I know we have some meat, but we don't want to eat it raw, because we might get poisoned, and I do not want to die. Okay, cook. Uh, we have meat. We can cook meat, yes. Oh, we can cook this. Any herbs and gobo. Oh, let's craft more. Let's craft a lot, actually. Nice. What else do we have in there? Sickness medicine, simple vegetable. We don't have any rice, but we have meat. Let's eat. Meals, 30. How much does the meat give me? 10. We'll eat that first. Our food bar went right up. I may have made a mistake putting my village in the middle of the map, but we're going to stick with it and see how we go. Since it's our house, we're going to build it right at the back here. Have these trees bordering. Um, how do I get to housing buildings? Houses. Small. Let's go here. Oh, is that sapling was in the way. What do I need for the foundation? Eight logs, any logs. Let's get chopping. That's the base done. What do I need for the any planks for the floor? We got heaps of planks. Oops. Simple door exterior stage. Oh, it says change. Wow. Look at that. Simple. Oh, okay, I can change this where I want it. Entrance limit one of three. Oh, so that means I can put another entrance. This is cool. Well, if I put an entrance at the back, we'll have this so it slides right. And then on the other side, uh, if we go left, so it's the same way. So it goes right through. And we've got to make sure that we have the right windows. We want to have a window out this way. We'll have large windows out the front. So put a small window at the back on each side next to our side entrances. 
and I've made all of the walls with a wooden base. We're going to stick with that. We have heaps of sticks. I think we have any, um, enough planks. Okay, we're out of conifer planks. So that means we need to find a conifer tree. These are the wrong types of trees. What's the best way to get the right tree? Yeah, I'm going to have to have a look around. Find these conifer trees. Does my map tell me anything about trees? Oh, we found our pine. I can also hear a boar. I'm not too sure if they're going to attack me though. I'm starting to lag on my game here a little bit. It's getting dark, but I've managed to get the conifer planks. I did have to go through the premium de Lucian forest. So at least I know where those trees are. And I've got plenty of the other trees surrounding this village. Time to finish off my house. Build a roof. So can I change the roof or is it all the same? I need two logs. I need some stone. Last few resources. Whoa. Essential furniture. Oh, you have to build everything in this. We've got just enough stone to get our fireplace going. Got a craftsman level. I need one more firewood. Oh, what does it take to get this? Straw. Where do I get straw from? Oh, no, wait. I saw that somewhere in handcrafting. Uh, straw. Grass. I have to get over and get some grass. One firewood. Yes, I've got that. That's all I needed. Yeah. And straw. Okay, I need grass. I've got heaps of grass on the next field over. The stamina on this game is very low. He doesn't run very far before he runs out of steam. Those are flowers. Where was my grass? Here it is. Well, the good thing is now that I've made one house, I now know what resources I need to make more. Let's craft more than we need. We'll craft all of it and then we'll grab some more grass. Restock on the grass. Okay, so I can change the season after two days or it's automatically changed after four days. It takes a very long time to build one house. Mind you, oh, now I have to talk to Toshichi, Toshichi again. Well, at least I've got a house, so let's sleep. Again, he's not even sleeping in the right position. You were like sleeping right next to the fireplace. Your head was like laying on that plank there. Brand new day, beautiful. I'm going to again have to head back and talk to Toshichi. Yeah, I know I've got some points of perks to unlock one. Cutting trees becomes second nature. Your axe swings are more powerful. Can I unlock this one? Yes, I can. Yeah, that's my counter there. Oh, these are the shrines. We have to discover those. Right, back to it. Um, I have made it back to the main village. It was a bit of a trick. It's going to get really annoying. Yes, I've built a house. First person I need to help is Aiko. Ako. I can finally offer her a place to live. So that lady we helped on the beach is going to join our village. A warrior, a priestess, and an impure. Okay, we know where the warrior is. He's at that, um, that outpost. We walked past him. That priestess I talked to, but she didn't say anything really much to me. Recruitment. This is why we're playing this game. Recruitment and having people work for you is like my favorite thing. Mm, mm, mm. So villagers have needs. They have food, beverages, and other goods. So I'm assuming that's when they have the luxuries. Chance they could leave forever. Okay, so I need to ask Aiko to join my village, but I think the best thing to do first, let's have a look what we have available to build. Okay, so the large house is the only one that does multiple people, whereas each of these small and standard is one person only. So that's not going to get us a lot of people in the village. We unlocked the charcoal kiln, the shed, simple storage we're going to have to get a well acquiring water we're slowly going to have to work our way through and figure out what each of these do this is a lot of stuff to learn global dynasty storage that means everybody can access this light tables seating containers fireplace this is a really fleshed out game here we've got forages furniture this is really neat yeah, so I just had a look at everything in there. 
for what we can build and there's a lot so if you got any tips on what i need to build first let me know i'm going to leave um Aiko there because we're going to have to build the house first if we don't have a house ready for her we're gonna be in trouble when uh, she does join because we're not gonna have any of the infrastructure to look after her we're gonna have no food no water we're gonna talk to one person on the way back to our village and see what the quest is but other than that um, I think it's best that we build the structures that we need first before we invite anybody to our village I was right this is where the warrior is so I've just tracked the quest and I'm gonna look for this little kid in the forest who's taking a sweet time and not coming back nice hat talk to me brother stop walking away three pieces of cooked meat how am I going to get three meat um can I throw this oh yes I can okay we're gonna give this a go we're not that great at hunting there's a here there they're running fast though oh there's one there's one there's one right there oh I got one that was a good shot and I have to equip my small knife to skin it we're pretty good at this this is easier to aim there's another one the bushes are always in the way oh the rabbits run off a squat again I think I have to be a little bit quicker with my throwing what else can he do with it Ooh. get in my way bro and I will shiv ya nice little prison shiv shiv what happens if I do this friendly fire is prohibited okay so I can't do that that's a bad idea I have the meat right here he wants it cooked you can't you cook it uh three that's all he needs that's all he's gonna get i'm keeping the rest can you stop moving this guy keeps moving i'm trying to talk to you mate i'm back here i'm gonna shiver you in a minute smash it with a hammer oh i missed i don't think you can oh i got it oh yeah whoops wrong button you can kill rabbits with a hammer it's kind of like that whack-a-mole game just grab your hammer and give them a bash just take everything we are scavengers in this world i'm going to head back to my village thanks for hanging out with me today we'll see you next time and we'll have some houses ready to go